Hello. I thought I would share with you my homemade version of Good Seasons Italian Salad Dressing Mix. It does use quite a few ingredients, but they are all uh, everyday standard pantry ingredients. So I'm just gonna take a few moments and go through those with you. And then we'll show you how much money you can save when you make this uh, dressing mix homemade. So here we go. I'd like to use the magic bullet to blend everything. And I use this spice blade. So Everything's going to be just put right into uh, the jar. So what we have here, and then when I use it, when I have it mixed up, I'll just transfer it over to this uh, spice jar where I have all the ingredients to make it the next time. And then I have the recipe for the dressing. So all the ingredients. So it's all handy when I need to refill it. I just look at the bottle and then I can go through uh, the ingredients. So what we use are, we use dehydrated carrots and dehydrated bell pepper. Now, a substitute for that, if you don't wanna dehydrate them yourself, is to use Aleppo red pepper. So we use that. Parsley. And this recipe, I'll have all the ingredients and the amounts on my website, therighteouskitchen.blogspot.com. This uses sea salt, or you can use a reduced sodium salt, granulated garlic. The recipe calls for onion powder, but I use chopped onion a lot, so what I do is just pulverize this into a powder and then I measure it for the recipe. Sugar, uh, black pepper, just everyday grind on black pepper. Sure gel, uh, you can find sure gel in the canning section at the grocery store. Oregano, rosemary, and thyme. Now, when I went, I was out of rosemary and thyme uh, for a jar like this size was $5 and I didn't really want to pay that. So I went to the Mexican aisle and looked at their spices and I got uh, this amount. Each of these were 88 cents. So that's always a good option if you don't want to spend a lot of money on spices is to check out that Mexican aisle. I get my cumin there too. And then this uses sweet basil. So all you do is you just put all of your ingredients in there with the spice blade and give it a quick whiz with the magic bullet. And then that's it, you're done. So let's go over the numbers for this. So this packet here is 0 0.7 ounces and that cost about $2. My recipe makes approximately 12 packets. This is a $24 worth of um, salad dressing mix. So that means that each packet is 27 cents using my homemade recipe. So do you wanna pay 27 cents and have this mix available whenever you wanna make salad dressing? Or do you wanna pay $2 each time you wanna make dressing? So that's pretty, pretty self-explanatory. I think we all wanna save money. Now let's look at this recipe. We have options when we're making the salad dressing. 
So this is the recipe. It's one fourth cup vinegar, three tablespoons water. And what you could do on the water amount is you can use concentrated juice like orange juice, apple juice, cherry juice, or pomegranate juice. Uh, and then you have a really great tasting vinaigrette and that uses olive oil. And then the two tablespoons of this dressing mix. So whenever I wanna make a salad dressing to impress, I take out my homemade uh, Good Seasons Italian dressing mix, and then I add my concentrated juice. So there you go. Two dollars or 27 cents. The choice is up to you. Thanks for watching.